Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, MacGirl25 Antonetta. So, I am here to do a review on the Maybelline Baby Skin Instant Pore Eraser. Everyone and their mother has been talking about this. And um, before Christmas, I, f I actually found it in the drugstore, so I picked it up. Um, even before everyone was raving about it. So I'm, I'm actually really, really impressed. The Instant Pore Eraser from Maybelline is supposed to be, as they say, a dupe for the Benefits Porefessional Face Primer. And the Benefit Porefessional Face Primer is um, 36, I think 36 or 38 dollars. Uh, for the same size, similar to the same size as this. Maybe a tiny bit bigger, but not by much. And, I mean, the Benefit Pore Professional is amazing. It's great. I have it. I use it. Um, it's an expensive product. So, you know, if you use it every day, you're going to go through it. And obviously, you're going to have to dish out $38 plus tax to go get another one. Whereas this is a great drugstore alternative. Now, um, I have never seen from, like the L'Oreal Miracle Blur, I find is more of a BB cream slash pore eraser. I don't know why, it just, it, it comes off more as like either a BB or a CC cream that you can use to correct as well. So, um, that's just my opinion. That's how I found it on my skin. I will do a review on the Miracle Blur in the near future. But, um, this one is quite similar to the Benefit Pore Professional. And this is the only drugstore brand that has come out with a face primer uh, to kind of compete with the high-end uh, face primers in Sephora or Actra Beauty Boutique when you go into your drugstore. Um, I think it's, did, what did I pay for this? I think I paid for $8. $8 for this little guy. And you know what? It actually is pretty good. So when I got home, I opened it up and I'm like, okay, now what is this going to be like? So when you squeeze, I don't know if you guys can see that. It's clear. See how clear that is? So it's clear. It's not a skin tone. The Porefessional from Benefit is a skin tone. So this is clear. This is claiming that it's an instant pore eraser. So when you place it on your hand and you rub it in, I don't know if you guys can tell that my skin kind of looks slightly different compared to what it looked like before I put it on my hand. See that? Um, so yeah, it does what it says, I think. Um, it does help keep your oils from coming up uh, into the, on to the surface of your skin. The longevity of it, I would think, is pretty decent. I usually put my makeup on at 7 o'clock in the morning. And I come home at like 6.30 at night and my face is a tad bit oily but it's not um, an oil slick as if I didn't have an actual face primer on. So I really am impressed with this little guy and you know what I was actually quite scared to try it at first because I figured oh my god it's a drugstore like you know, you think of drugstore products, you think of how they used to be back in, in the day, 10 years ago, where it, you, you basically paid for what you got. Um, now I'm finding that the drugstore brands are really focusing on getting the product comparable to high-end brands so that more people will start to um, purchase the drugstore brand opposed to the high-end brand. And... Honestly, I, I'm actually really impressed with this. I was scared at first, I'm not going to lie, but I'm really impressed with this. Uh, you can wear it 
on its own if you don't want to put foundation on top or you don't want to put a BB cream you can wear it on its own just to kind of hide your pores if you have a like really really large pores where I hide mine is just here around my um, nose area and just uh, just here above my cheeks my t-zone so here in the forehead down the nose and then a little bit here I will um, I'll put just a tiny bit uh, to kind of keep control my oil because I do break out a lot down here and um, it is hormonal breakouts but it's just it's really nice to be able to even out the pores in this area when I'm wearing a foundation or a BB cream so uh, I really do love this I think it's great I think it's a great alternative uh, drugstore brand uh, that you can select opposed to high-end products. I mean, let's face it, yeah, you know, I love the professional, but I can't be running out every time I run out of that stuff to go buy a brand new bottle for $38 a pop. Like, come on. So um, this is actually really great. I really love how it's cheap. It works. It does the job. The only thing that it doesn't do is even out my skin tone like the professional does because it doesn't have that skin um, that skin tone um, tint to to this like the professional does. The professional does have a tiny tint to it, and it does. I find that it does even out some of the redness in my skin. This one does not because it doesn't have anything. It's just clear, um, which is fine by me. I'm not really. Um, I'm not really picky about it to begin with anyways because I figure I'm going to be putting a BB cream that's tinted or even a foundation on top so it's going to cover it anyways. Um, yeah. I said um in this lot. I'm really sorry guys. Uh, it's just one of those days where I feel kind of blah. Anyways, so this is a thumbs up in my eyes. If you guys have the opportunity to, please go check this out at your local drugstore. You probably won't find it um, too expensive. I mean, I got it mine at uh, Walmart for like, I think, less than 8 bucks. So it's actually a pretty good steal for, for this. And you only need a little bit of the product when you apply it after, you know, for every app makeup application. So this should last you for quite a while. It is a pretty... Um, it's a pretty decent sized tube. It's about 20 milliliters, 0.67 fluid ounces. So I know it looks big right now because I'm showing it to you close up, but um, it, it's here. Let's do this. It's a pretty decent size. So it is clear, guys. Just keep in mind. Um, it does help keep oils away, but it doesn't. Um, minimize oils completely so just keep that in mind don't think that this is going to be a miracle worker and you're going to put this on and you're not going to have any oil coming through uh throughout the day personally for me i mean i am really 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 oily in my t-zone and um when i used this uh it did it did help minimize the amount of oil that came through i did have a tiny bit of oil come through but it wasn't uh, anything noticeable where you could see a shine or anything like that which which is a good sign so if you're really really oily you don't want to spend the money on a professional then go grab this test this baby out i'm sure that you will be decently surprised um, regarding this product since it is drugstore uh, I really did enjoy it and I love it. So I'm actually excited that we have another option in the drugstore for a face primer because I don't want to dish out $38 every time I run out of professional. Anyways, guys, that was my review. Very simple, very quick. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys have the rest of the rest of your day. You enjoy the rest of your day. Uh, I can't talk today. Um, for any of you who are wondering what is on my lips, I am wearing... I think I'm wearing Black Cherry by Milani. No, I'm wearing Sangria by Milani. I lied. I'm wearing Sangria by Milani. And that is it. If you guys uh, could subscribe, that would be awesome. Because you know you want to subscribe. I'm just, you know, asking very nicely. Uh, to those of you who are already subscribed, thank you so much for continuing to follow me and follow my journey on this YouTube trail. Um, and if you haven't checked out my blog, please go check out my blog, macgirl25.blogspot.ca. I hope you guys have a good day and the rest of your day you enjoy, and we will talk to you in my next video. Bye, guys.